I know. I mean, that's what I'm sort of going through this process now of thinking like, okay, you know, how can I find a spot for myself in the way things work? And some people are saying you get to a point where it's just like you could starve doing that, and you have to say fuck it and find a way to do it almost in spite of your condition. Totally. And it's sort of I know that this isn't um, celebrated in Canada, but there is that fuck it wild wild west attitude in the states where it's like my shit's the best like yeah. my shit's the best. of course you're gonna want to see my shit do you yeah. know what i mean and i think we could use a little of that yeah. not like you need to see it as very important yeah. you know which yeah. i think is our canadian sort of it's it's yeah. an important piece to see yeah. how about it's just the shit and, and people are gonna want to watch it like yeah. is anyone gonna watch it like would yeah. you watch it yeah yeah, yeah. okay i'm off my soapbox <laughs> <laughs> Oh. No, I think because I find that irritating. I do find it, um, I don't know, I was talking to somebody here who works for the CRTC, and she was talking about the importance of Canadian film and television. And, um, and I said, I have a hard time sometimes finding Canadian films, not so much television, but Canadian films that speak to me. Yeah. And she was like, are you kidding? Like, there's so much Canadian, you know, films out there. And I was like, oh, so what's the last Canadian film you went to go see? Yeah. And I'm still waiting for the answer. You know, like yeah. it's that thing that, of course, we should see it because yeah. it's important. And I agree with that. We should yeah. support our culture. But, but are we watching them? No. Mm -hmm. And don't you think part of it is our responsibility? We can't just blame the system. If you're a filmmaker, part of it is: are you making films that people want to see? Interestingly enough, I think I'm trying to combine a little bit of my experience in Los Angeles mm -hmm. and not go the traditional route, which is to be completely dependent on government grants or even on the broadcasters here. Because I'm getting into transmedia and mm -hmm. doing, I'm coming at it from, um, like I optioned a novel, Canadian Caribbean science fiction novel by now, Lil Hopkinson, called Brown Girl in the Rain. And I'm adapting it into transmedia. And normally what you would do is then you would then write the script and then pitch it to um, telefilm, right? And then they would fund it. What I'm doing is I'm going to go through the back end and get advertisers to, to integrate brands into the mobile app, have that feed into the story, and then maybe work that backwards and then go to telefilm and make the actual narrative story. Yeah. And the reason I'm doing that, not just to be funky, it's I actually think, and my experience has been, even pitching here at Man, American advertisers are all about the money. And in some ways, it's a great way for me to gauge whether or not anyone's going to even watch this film. So if they're, if they're sort of saying, oh, interesting, yeah, I like that, I like that concept, they're not saying it for any other reason except that they think that they'll be able to get money. And so, in some ways, for me, it's a good indication that somebody's actually interested in, in the concept and the story that I'm developing. And then, once that's that's um, funded in that way, then I'll probably go the traditional route and feed it both ways, you know. And then that property will live on. There'll be different multiple entry points in that property. So there'll be a mobile app. There'll be the narrative story. There'll probably be a social media game or whatever. Even though game is a bad word. Um, I'd rather say like social media immersive experience, you know, because game, you know, you picture a 17 year old guy sort of yeah. on a console and it's not that. And I still think it's an important piece of work, but yeah. I just don't, um, I really want somebody to see it. Yeah, yeah, I think that's important to me.